in the letter from Pakistan and you're watching my YouTube channel Insani Upihad which aims to invoke a little bit of humanity in all of us through awareness and understanding. So updates and some good updates. Um, I was hoping that China would take the initiative and Xi Jinping would either invite the Ukrainian and the Russian president to, for talks and to meet up or, you know, visit Russia and to talk one-on-one -on -one, one -on -one with Putin and talk some sense into this whole conflict and stop the bloodshed and bring peace. Well, guess what? It was yet another uh, leader from the Jewish community, <laughs> a very Jewish nation. Actually, in fact, I was quite proud and happy because right after Shabbat, this development had uh, come across and I was not watching um, any, I was not using any of the electronics, so I was not updated of the current happenings around the, around this conflict. It was such a delight that, um, a delight to know that Israeli Prime Minister Naftali Bennett had uh, visited Kremlin and met uh, with Volodymyr Putin and then called Vol Volodymyr <laughs> Zelensky and um, it shows a lot of guts and a lot of responsibility uh, of Bennett and uh, Israel and it also shows that you know uh, this courage of Yehuda and being the lion of, of uh, Hashem and to correct and perfect this 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 world and take initiatives courageous courageous and brave initiatives towards peace and righteousness and bring light to this world such a delight again i was appreciating uh, two volodymyrs the zelensky and the putin now i would um even more praise and appreciate efforts from my favorite country which is Israel of course um, and the head of state of Israel uh, Naftali Bennett for this great great much needed effort to reach out to Putin reach out to Zelensky and resolve this issue and work things out work the middle grounds between the two and stop this bloodshed and um, bring peace as soon as possible. And again, it is such a disappointment that Asian media, that is particularly Indian media and Pakistani media, are doing nothing but um, putting um, petrol on the fire, spreading lies, propaganda, uh, propaganda news, and moreover, fake news. It was, it was heartbreaking to see that how these media outlets can be so self-centered and could just, they, the only thing that they uh, know is how to sensationalize conflicts, if, uh, giving zero to none thoughts for people who are dying or people whose lives are at stake, both the Ukrainian lives and the Russian lives and the lives beyond are at stake. Um, in terms of losing loss of life and also in terms of economic, uh, you know, casualty. So, um, very bad times, but I'm seeing two amazing Jewish leaders doing such brave and courageous acts and one very non-Jewish, but uh, very best, a person who uh, has very close uh, Jewish friends and to do something, um, you know, for their countries and for the world. So such great times. Thank you. I hope and pray that peace is brought to the world and especially to Eastern Europe. All the all all the prayers, all the luck for this initiative to be fruitful in regards to peace. Uh, pray for Ukraine, pray for Russia, pray for the entire world. Thank you.